fuck happened to my wall? Oh, the fan. Wow! I'm not even kidding. It's literally right. the fan. The fan was too powerful. I wish it was more powerful. All right, so we got an interesting matchup here. Uh, don't worry about it. More items, because you know we all love seeing. Oh. Hey man, just commentate. <laughs> don't take the match. Forget Sorry. The, get the fu forget about the. Sorry, stuff. Devin. All right, I feel like. I don't, don't, know, let him, don't let him play with any more toys. All right, he's already messed up with the muffin. Oh, I haven't even gotten started yet. I haven't even gotten started with the muffin. Speaking of playing with toys and items, this is the best set for it. That's right. The start to Smashville, I think, is more interesting than anything else. I feel like Peach performs extremely on Smashville. Yeah, I feel like it'd be a little worse for Sinji, given how little real estate that Smashville has to offer. But, of course, percentages don't reflect this. And Sinji has shown in the past proficiency with controlling the entirety of the stage, if he gets good positioning with his bonus fruit and his uh, fire hydro. All right, though. Yeah, both these guys, you know, Lingling, I love how he's just been navigating just ever so slightly out of the, out of Sinji's uh, zone to throw items. And I love how he's been playing turnips at, at good times. However, you give Sinji more tools as well. You know, it's, it is worth noting that, like, Ling isn't rusty in this matchup by any means. He gets a good enough amount of practice in the Pac-Man matchup thanks to Kiwi back home in Connecticut. So, like, even though they have two different styles of Pac-Man play, like, Ling Ling is well aware of how he needs to combo this monster. Yeah, the fundamental mantra of this, of, you know, this matchup remains the same across most players, you know? A little bonk on the head. Sinji, though, doing a pretty good job of keeping uh, Ling Ling out right now. My man has not been able to navigate. This should be an easy edge guard. Okay, great job. I love that. I love that down tilt. Love it. That was so good to poke the parasol out right before. He still traded with it, too, but it worked. I wasn't even aware that there was a trade. Whoa! I've never seen a reset with a single hit there. That was wild. You know, half the time, I have to believe that Sinji just sort of, like, does Definitely, this stuff on the floor. Yeah, I was going to say. My man. <laughs> Yo, drag down down airs. Hype that. Yo, Pac-Man's like, I'm going to be the one to step on you, bro. All you uh -oh. nerds in Twitch chat, Pac-Man's going to step on you. Not Peach. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't think Devin liked that one. Press one of you Pac-Man down throw Pac-Man. <laughs> How's that for irony? Anyway. Sinji up three stocks to one right now. Ling Ling not been able to mitigate. Sinji's just been able to play his game a lot more. I think it's just because Peach is kind of slowish aerial drift. Yeah, rip the homie real quick. Peach is kind of slowish, like aerial drift, and, and her floating kind of forces her to slow down on her approaches to Sinji, and it gives Sinji all the more time to set up his traps. And Sinji's been winning these trades really, really nicely. Turnip pull also takes a considerable amount of time as well, and unlike other projectiles that Sinji's had to face tonight, um, Turnip, you know, is innately good or innately average once it comes out. He's also enabled Ling Ling to not be able to get any of his Twitter combos on him, which is really good. <laughs> so he's been out of a, a safe distance to where that turnip won't lead him to a true follow-up. He's making sure to linger back with his projectiles. That way he, he lets them do the fighting for him. Like, Ling can't safely float because he has to worry about Fire Hydra and the bonus. Ignoring the bell right there just to opt for that. Setting up for another ledge trap. Yeah, Sinji's just been playing at such a comfortable distance this entire game. Ling Ling has really not been able to find a way in whatsoever. That was a cute crowd. Okay, I, I'm very interested to see how brazenly Ling Ling has been going off stage. My man has been trying to get those kills mad deep every single time. Wow, that the Peach Bomber hurls you pretty far. I didn't realize how far it hurled you. My man's getting the whole orchard thrown at him right now. And he, has, he, can't, he has no answers. The fruit are doing work. Yeah. Peach, you know, Peach being a fruit herself, you know. Not able to deal with other members of her family. That sounds rough. Sibling rivalry there. Yeah, but Ling Ling, I believe, just hasn't been able to find any answers to how Sinji's just been approaching this matchup. You know, how how, how will she get in? The, you know, the homie Hydra? The homie Hydra. Yeah. So for those of you who don't know, the, the bell does have a hurt box on it, but it doesn't really hurt Pac-Man at all because it's an animate object. You know, I feel like it, it's worth pointing out like how much of a timer beater this matchup has been. Look at that. My man gave him the get him out of here. 83 rain boots coming out of him. <laughs> My man rolled straight out of H&M with those. He's out here. 
But like that's that match went on for a fair amount of time. No, it did. And one move that uh, I was about to say, Pelka. Whoa, Ling Ling didn't get out too often. Was fair. He wasn't really able to get any. I feel like because fair would have been an overcommitment on the hydrant. He's just been unable to find any way in. And you can see this man's thinking. This man's at the drawing board right now, trying to just, like try to pick a good stage. I think Smashville was honestly fine because if he goes to any bigger of a stage, he's going to be putting himself at even more of an disadvantage. And he doesn't want to go to FD because that's Cindy's best stage. Like the stages that are left on the board aren't particularly great for Ling to play. I'd honestly go Lilat here. TBH. Like the Lilat would be a great CP. The only reason I wouldn't say Lilat is just because that's so much space that gets denied from Peach with the bell on hand. All right, going to Kalos. I know that Ling Ling likes this stage a lot too, so, you know, and I'm sure that the platforms will be an additional aid to cutting off Sinji's escape options, so we'll see. On top of that, the bell, like, it's going to get caught on those platforms at the ledge, so Sinji's ledge pressure isn't going to be as stifling. <laughs> Still going to be something to worry about. Yeah, for sure. But not as bad. Yeah. No complaints here. All right, though, hopping into Kalos. Game two. Oh, I love this theme. Good choice. I, it wasn't intentional, but I mean, good choice by the game. Oh, we can go and shopping real quick. I actually like that option. I mean, you know, while Sinji's taking the time to set up his stuff, I think pulling more tournaments should, would, will, especially those of stronger variety, will actually hamper Sinji's gameplay. So I like that. It's a, little, it's a creative little solution to the problems he's presented so far. The problem is that Ling Ling isn't getting an opportunity to use these terms, even when he does pull them. Like, we even, we saw him pull a Stitch last time, we saw him pull a Saturn, and he never got an opportunity to do anything with either of those. My man is taking the strategy, if you can't beat him, join him. Like, he's, he's, he's just been setting himself up for Island Play. He's been trying to camp, circle camp Sinji. Don't know how that's going to work out, because he's kind of been losing trades for it. Few men like, are braver than him. I feel like you can't beat Sinji at his own game. Like, even Jewel was still, like, interacting to a certain extent. Ling Ling has kind of been just waiting patiently. Now he's got the, the Stitch, though? Yeah, again, it's a matter of, like, yeah, he's got it, but is What's he going to do with it? Yeah. To use it. Just spikes into the ground there. You see, now you invited Sinji to a stall. Now Sinji's anyway. doing the same thing. This man is an Olympic medalist in being able to run the clock in Smash. So I don't know why you wanted this to be a This thing. guy must not finish any of his tests. <laughs> My man's sitting in a college class. Every second. Ricardo, it's... Test has been over for two hours. Like, you said that I have 135 minutes to take this test. <laughs> I will take every one. One question, one. <laughs> I just wrote my name. <laughs> I will get every point that I can get. <laughs> I'm doing the bonus questions. And there you go. Finally, fairing the hydrant. I feel like fair innately is just powerful enough on its own to, to get the hydrant out of there. It's a bit of an overcommittal, especially if Sinji has key out. But Ling Ling yeah. gets meloned. I was going to say he's been doing a great job holding on to the stock, but, you know, I guess I uh, F me, right? See, now that's the problem, is oh. that, like, Link finds himself into a rhythm, but that rhythm is not on Sinji's call. So Yo, Sinji, Sinji with these scrabs on the landings. Ling Ling's not been able to... I feel like Ling has just also been coming down a little bit too aggressively. Once he's in Sinji's face, he kind of doesn't know what to do. I feel like by counterpicking the stage, he actually gave Sinji more options to escape when he's on stage. I'm kind of sad Toad didn't kill. Yeah, no, me too. There we go. Oh, oh. but at what cost? One stock. Precisely. The cost of one stock. You too can edge guard Pac Man. And now Sinji. I love how long does the turnip stay there once it's implanted state? I don't know. You should know these things. Oh my god. That would have been. See, bananas. what I do know is that that pressure is clean. Why doesn't Sinji have, why doesn't Pac-Man have bananas? Because they're not a bonus fruit in Pac-Man. Because he is bananas. That's why. Hydrant. No, just opting for the dare there. Sinji's looked so comfortable in this matchup. I don't know how many Peaches he's played against, or how much he's played against Ling Ling. What the hell happened? What just happened? I need the replay on deck because I don't... I need slow-mo. I think the Hydrant had something to do with Did that he hit one. him back into the Hydrant because the Hydrant oh, hit more than once? That was, some that was a comedy act right there. Okay, so... Did he fare him back into the Hydrant? <laughs> I, need I, love how, I love how it eggs with Pac-Man standing there charging the fruit, too. Okay. Oh, Link caught... <laughs> it just bounced. He caught up to the Fire Hydrant. He caught up to it. He, he raced it, dude. He really raced the Fire Hydrant.
<laughs> oh my god. I love how we have slow mo. Oh man, I just wiped Mo-Mo- my nose on Mo-Mo- stream. It's Mo-Mo- like, that's type awkward. stuff. That's 